Um, what's up, guys? It's um, Pippi's Reviews here today, and here now I'm starting a new series. It's um, NHL 2011-2012 predictions. Um, I'm gonna be doing this team by team. I'm probably gonna be posting up a new video almost every day, if not every other day. Um, but this episode, I'm going to be focusing on my team, the Washington Capitals. Um, overall, I think the Washington Capitals have probably had the best offseason so far, if not one of the best. Um, I mean, they got Vokun. That was probably their best move, or one of the best moves. Um, overall, I think the best move was trading Varlamov. I mean, he, like... He was a really good goalie, don't get me wrong, but he got injured too much. I mean, they were saying he might get back to the KHL, too. So, um, we also got a first-round pick, and uh, I don't know if it's two second-round picks from Colorado or just a second-round pick from either 2012 or 2013. Um, I don't know, but Colorado, you got to think, they're not a really good team. They're probably going to do crappy this year. I mean... They got, like, Shiger and Varlamov. Um, I think Varlamov's just going to collapse. And Shiger, I think, was injured. I might be wrong. Um, I think Colorado is not going to be a very good team this year. And that could be the deciding factor if the Caps are going to get, like, a top 10 or top 5 pick, maybe in first overall. I don't know yet. The offseason isn't done. There probably is going to be a couple more moves. Um, but, yeah. We'll get in the Capitals got Troy Brower, we trading him we traded him from uh, sorry there for the delay. We got him from Chicago. Um we traded our first round pick away from him during the draft. I think that was a smart move. This draft wasn't looking that good, so I think George McPhee knew what he was doing. Um let's see we got Joel Ward. Um, he's a really good grinder. Um, he did excellent in the playoffs. I mean, I don't know his exact stats, but I know that they were really good. Um, let's see. We got back good old boy Jeff Halpern. If any of you Caps fans know, he was, um, grew up in Potomac, Maryland. He was a really good player. He got signed by the Caps when he was young. Um, yeah. Let's see what else we got. We got... Um, we got, um, Thomas Vokun. I think he's going to be good this year. I mean, he was on Florida. Come on. And he was still putting up, like, a 92 save percentage. I mean, don't get me wrong. He's going to be good with the Capitals. And finally, he has a good team to play with. I mean, he hasn't really had a good team to play with all of his career. Um, besides when he was in Nashville. And let's see who else we got, um. Yeah, that's pretty much all we got. Um, we got rid of Hannon. Um, we traded away Fair, and we traded him for this prospect, Danik Pequay. I don't think he's going to be that good. He was playing in the ECHL this year. That's not a good sign, but we also got a third-round pick. Um, we also dumped some cap from that, and we were um, able to sign Carl Lausner for a two-year deal. Um, I think that was good. Alsner is one of our, like, core defensive prospects. And, um, yeah, some of the up-and-comers. We got Kuznetsov. He's going to be up and um, ready in the next season probably. Um, we got Dmitry Orlov. He was a second-round pick in 2009. He's going to be playing with the Bears this year. Um, let's see what else. We got Cody Eakin and Matthew Perreault. Um, I think they're going to be switching from time to time. Here, I'll give you the lines right now. I think sticking lines. 